Hello everyone, my name is Travis Garrison and welcome to my video. First, I want to give my Creator, Yah, and my Redeemer, Yahshua, all the honor, glory, and praise. He's, he's uh, a great, well, I mean, it's unima unimaginable, uncomprehendable about our Creator. But anyway, I'm going to get on with this. This is part two. I've done Prince William first. Um, now I'm going to do his brother. You know, a little bit of information on his brother. He, I'm sure he is involved with... Um, with this Serco, you know, it, 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 they say Prince William owns the Serco. Um, but, you know, I'm sure Harry's got some, I'm sure he has some ownership to it too. So thought I'd do him next on possible faces of the Antichrist. Um, Cause these people have some pretty interesting birth charts. So this is a circle. Now this is Prince Harry. He made a. I mean that chart there is pretty. Um, I mean it's pretty. It's a. Cause here's a um, regular, you know, just a normal person that's not royalty or whatever. But you know they they make a. They scatter out on the chart because we receive frequency and vibration from the sun, moon, and stars. And this is what this is showing. This is like the night he was day he was born. Several um, on this. You know, it's just kind of a, what I call just a normal, you know, every uh, a normal no, normal person. But anyway, um, that's this is Prince Harry's. That's pretty. I mean, that's that's pretty. Uh, he had some. There's something really going on with this guy here, you know, too. So, cause this is this show. This is showing you bloodlines, really showing the bloodlines of of the rulers of the world. The, I mean how they were born and all that. But anyway, I want to go over here to Stellarium and see. This is when, all right, this is um, 1984, September 15th. Now, I was born on September the 8th, and my grandson was born on September the 19th, and my dad was born on September 13th. So all, most all my grandparents were born in September. So it's kind of interested me that Prince Harry was born in September too. But... Mercury is like a messenger, I believe, you know, uh, there's so many stories to these sun, moon, and stars, you know, people's done over the years that they want to confuse you, but uh, what I thought was interesting, really, about Harry's birth chart, the sun is at the, because we're born all out of this uh, womb area, right here in, in the Virgin, they, they, the Israel, that's who it really is, Israel, that's born out of this womb right here, but Venus was in the womb a little bit, but Saturn was right here, I mean, just at the feet. So Saturn was influencing this birth here, too. You know, I mean, that's what it appears to me, that it's, and the moon is at the Taurus. So the, I believe that's extend, you know, kind of gives significance of a, of a um, pretty of strong character somehow, you know, and Sagittarius, Jupiter's in Sagittarius. So that tells you that, I believe that Sagittarius is, um, Jupiter's a king planet, so and it's in Sagittarius, like the rider on the white horse is on. Is is that's what that Sagittarius really means? Is the, the rider on the white horse in in the Book of Revelation? That's what Sagittarius is, and the the king planet's right there. That in this that night he was born. Um, Mars is at Scorpius, and so is Uranus. You know they're they're both right there in that constellation. So. Um, these people are involved with war somehow, because there's Mars and Scorpius. That's a serpent type of a, you know, that wants to sting you. Saturn is right there as um, as Prince Harry's been born. Saturn is right there at the, it's still in the constellation of uh, the Virgin, the Virgo. They call her Virgo. But uh, so whatever is coming, whatever is happening there, it's trying to influence what's being born, who's being born. It's it's influencing that that child. That baby that's that's been in the womb, it's 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 getting in. It's I just believe that's what it means, cause Saturn stands for Satan. Uh, so anyway, let's see. Did I finish here? I don't know if I got finished with Prince Harry or not. Uh, I think that's all I'm gonna say about him. But he's got a pers I mean, it's pretty interesting his his birth chart and when he was born. Now, everybody already go check their birth chart out because this is pretty significant right here, how this chart made. 
Um, Cause see, he had, this is like kind of like my my kids is that a lot of these planets and stars line up all in one area, and then they it just goes back and forth, back and forth. It's influencing this child that's been born with frequency and vibration. Because if you want to understand creation, you have to that Tesla. Everybody's heard of him. Says made a statement. If you want to understand creation, think in terms of frequency, vibration, and energy. Well, we're getting that frequency, vibration, and energy from the sun and moon and stars. That's what the word, of the scripture says, our creator says. That's how he creates us, with a with a word, a frequency somehow, you know. I don't really understand it all, but I, I've got a pretty good idea in my head, I think, of just a little bit of what, how we are created. And... Um, Thank you all for coming to my channel. I'm going to do another video on all the faces of the Antichrist, all the ones that's been shown to us. I'm going to do all of them. And uh, and uh, I believe he, I know he's here because they placed that um, that dragon-looking thing at the United Nations, that lion, leopard, whatever it is, you know, with the wings on it. So uh, that's, the, that's probably the image that they will make speak or something. You know, I don't know that because there's so many... They, they have image tools now that they can make holograms of people wherever. And, um, you know, like the Pope, they said, as a report said that he died. And, and uh, then one day he was in a, making a speech and he just all of a sudden disappeared. You know, it was an image software, image uh, applications. And Donald Trump was using it when they had brought this, uh, brought this, uh, this, this pandemic thing on. They was using that image uh, the 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 tool was sitting right in the room they was uh, they was doing the speeches from but what was noted what I noticed all their eyes were black so you know I don't think they got it quite perfected but it's enough to trick people especially through a TV that you can't see some of the uh, what those images really are because one lady I think her name was um, Rosa um, Hannah Rose or something like that. She's she's really good at catching that because she made the. Uh, I'll see if I can find her channel and y'all can go watch some of hers where they. You can see the neck is not attached to the body and stuff. You know when they use this image software because it's not per, it's not perfected yet. They they're not God so they 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 can't do it right. I mean they can get close to trick you enough to trick you. But thank y'all for coming. I'm gonna end this video. And I'm gonna do.